What is up, people on YouTube? We're about to jump into Snake RX New Game Plus right here, right now. Starting with a party of eight. What do we got? Ranger, Rogue. We always go healer. We always go infester. Maybe we should try something else. We got two healers out the gate, though. I'm going to go dual gunner. It seems like I'm going really, really fast. Is this normal? All right, dual gunner, you're going to need to bring something to the table here. This is going to be enough. Ranger build, maybe. We'll see. I think healers are just good. I don't think that there's like a, a build that you shouldn't have healer in, but... Dual gunner pog. This seems kind of shit. We can go mercenary. Deal two dimes damage to a single random enemy where X is how much gold you have. You sure are. We can go cursor. Curses three nearby enemies indefinitely with debt. Dealing 13 damage a second. So that's going to be a curse and a DOT. Uh, Cryomancer nearby enemies take 18.2 damage per second. This is a mage voider. Duel is quick from what I've heard. This looks cool. This is, uh, it's pretty fun. You know, this has local co-op. I think, I don't, I don't know, but I'm going to say no, it does not. Ah, huh, void. Kill him with debt. I'm going to try gambler here. Of course, we only have one gold, so it's not going to do a whole lot, but. We're going to randomly do damage equal to. X amount of my money. Miss your shots. You suck. You suck at this. First day. Shoot the green ones and everything gets a speed boost. White ones will stop and do ranged attacks. Purple ones explode and babies. Get more mercenaries so you can get more money. Yeah, that's that's the idea. Doing it. Merchant, there we go. There's my second mercenary. So here's our classes so far. We have a range, ranger rogue and a mercenary sorcerer. This is a sorcerer voider. This is a rogue. This is a mercenary. Gain plus one interest for every 10 gold up to a maximum of 10. The merchant doesn't actually fire on anybody. But here we have... Uh, we have two of them, so we get plus 8% chance for enemies to drop gold on death. If we can get four of them, we get a 16% chance. Would you have to pay a merc? Nope. Mercs get you more money. No, I don't. Yeah. You have a point. Alright, we're not one-shotting them. We have, a, we have a problem. We can also, we can note the, uh, the passive damage that we're doing from the, the gambler. Very minimal extremely minimal like maybe a tenth of their health don't shoot the green guys and they get that speed boost a reverse merc or creme. Creme de la creme. Oh, another wave. Didn't see that. We can touch them. We take damage. The health of all of my units are down below. The bars underneath them is how fast they recharge their shots if they shoot. And then the actual... Oh, hey, money. Oh, that's pretty good. Have, has nobody dropped money, or have I just not noticed? The health is denoted by the actual, like, filled in of the, of the pieces. <sighs> Chance for constructs to taunt nearby enemies on attack. I don't even know what a construct is. I'm assuming that means, like, when we're dropping a carver or a turret. Psyker orbs. We don't have psykers. AOE attacks. We don't have AOE attacks. 
8% chance for all attacks to spawn a healing orb on kill. I might just re-roll this one and go for something that helps me here and now. Healing strike could be good, but... It's so... Eh, you know? D6 it. The first re-roll is always free. Echo Barrage. Create secondary AoEs on AoE hit. I really like Echo Barrage if we had AoE. Lightning Strike. Chance for a projectile to create chain lightning. At a 5, 10, or 15% chance if I upgrade it. Burning Strike. 15% chance for attacks to burn doing extra DPS. DOT. Gravity Field creates an area that pulls enemies in for one second on Sorcerer Spell Repeat. We have one Sorcerer. That's our Gambler. I don't know what spell repeat means. We'll try lightning strike. Double merchant. So the merchant that does plus one for every 10 gold up to a maximum of 10 is going to upgrade to level two because we got three of them. Plus one for every 10 up for a maximum of 10. Okay, so tier two didn't do anything, but tier three. That means that we have to get three more for another tier two, and then three more for another tier two, so that's six more merchants. We'll get to level three. Your first item reroll is always free. Mm, is it that good? Well... Spawns an automation that shoots a projectile that deals 13 damage. That's probably what they mean by construct. Lightning will kill the green ones. It's bad. It's too late, isn't it? I don't know. Uh, we just don't have the damage. We might be in trouble. Yeah, that, that lightning didn't do a whole lot. Of course, it's, it's not upgraded. It's just level one. I'm more interested in them dropping money on death. The whole merchant guilds. It's just, it didn't help me. I, I spent a bunch of money for what, right? To potentially maybe get to level three in one day. To potentially get free rerolls. It's like, what's blue do? I don't remember what blue does. Let's kill it. Oh, shoots. Death blast. So that was five plus five plus three interest there. I think that meant five gold for winning, five gold for the enemy drops, and three for the interest gains on my the amount of money that I have. AoE damage stuns enemies for four seconds. See if I had that AoE one. We should have just gone for it. Wizard. Mage nuker. We don't have any mage nukers. Shoot a projectile that deals 14 AoE. An archer, another ranger. If I can get three rangers, we have 8% chance to release a barrage of attacks. I guess we'll, we'll do it. Do it. Another archer, another gambler. If I can get a level three gambler, a chance to cast the attack two, three, four times. Make, but on steroids. Is that a piercing shot from my archer? That's kind of cool. Once again, we might end up killing things that we don't want to, like the green guys. The chain lightning and the piercing. We're fine. We're fine. See how fine we are? Don't kill the green guy, please. Ah! You can upgrade that. I, I I think there's an upgrade where you heal and picking up gold. Maybe I'm wrong. More money, please. Drop money, please.
This archer chain lightning enemies too. Yeah, this is just on every single projectile. Vagrant shoots a projectile that deals 11.5 damage. It also gives me plus 15% attack speed and damage per active class to allied explorers. I don't have any more explorers. Level 2 Chain Lightning Go. We're just... I don't think we're, like, leveling up fast enough here. We're not getting enough damage. Elite. It's the green one. He's gonna, uh, periodically charge up all the enemies. He keeps going. Keeps spawning enemies until we kill him. Maybe we could farm money. If we tried not to kill him immediately. Maybe we could just flat out die too, it's, you know. That's a thing. Nope, that's, that's not where I wanted to go. I bounced off the wall like really, really weirdly there. Up to you, Archer. Nope, 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 nope. We're dead. You kick off the wall in ways that just don't make any sense to me. I hated that run. That was a really fucking bad run. Jester? Cursors? It just seems like, I don't know. It seems like there's a lot of builds, but every single other one looks like fucking trash. Oh, I don't kill them. I just curse them. They don't take any damage. Come back here and I'll bite your arms off. Easy. Scout. In. The warrior. I don't know if I'm totally sold in the warrior. Then I actually shoot them so the cursed ones will explode without me having to hit them with my face. where this is going. What up, Judy? How about healing? No, mages! AOE attack. They really do make you, like, pick. So, like, let's say you want to go classes. There's a bunch of sorcerer or blue classes, but not all of them have AOE. So, you could actually multi-class and instead go for AOE. You know, you could have a one warrior, you could have one sorcerer, you could have, like, that going on. You could have a sorcerer that also spawns minions. It's like, you gotta really mix and match appropriately. Psychosync, psycho orbs. You don't have any psycho orbs. Dividends, mercenaries deal X plus X percent damage. That would have been nice when we had a mercenary build. Haste, 50% movement speed that decays over four seconds on healing or pickup. We don't have healing orbs. Noxious strike, chance for attacks to poison. I'm gonna reroll. 
Psyker Orb. Damage over time. Global damage, defense, and ASPD if you have one or more enchanters. And at least take more damage. Just more damage. What I say to that? Choked on it. Poison and exploding enemies? 8% chance. Remember when people were trying to tell me that uh, the hosts were bad? The minions? The critters? Funny. That's funny. Those are funny times. AoE stun enemy. Just not going for that. Let's bump that up to 20% damage increase. 8% is better than no damage. Uh, you understand, though, that by taking an 8% chance to poison, I am forfeiting whatever else that I might be taking. I didn't just throw it away. You can't just build your argument around this, like, infallible, like, well, you're just wrong because of this. I had other things. There were other options. Critter build's great. What is this game? I want to play too. Snake RX. S N K R X, I believe. Look that I've learned from being in so many shitty relationships in my life is that people have no fucking clue how to argue. There we go. Scout me, jester me. Of course, we're not any better by buying them. Even though we have two things here, we still just have one that does the same thing. It's not until you get to level three that it uh, really steps it up. We have an elite fight. YOLO. The green. Trapped in the corner. I gotta run! <laughs> this also does not feel like the build. Weak. This feels weak. Finish him off. Finish him off. Just hit him. Okay, that was a mistake. I'll be the first to admit. We got this. We got this. Easy. Centipede. Plus movement speed. Lasting seven. Position seven. That won't happen for a while. Critters block. Okay. Where's my poison again? Infester, here's my chance to get critters. Arcanist launches a slow moving orb that launches projectiles. Is this a sorcerer too? No, just a mage. A magician is a mage. Who knew? No Bell, thanks for the 55 months. The pot's killing it on YouTube. I'm trying to do the best I can. Pick up gold releases four homing projectiles, so they're not dropping gold. Get one mercenary in there for the beginning. 16% chance for poison, go. Infest me, daddy. I just... Two of my successful runs have been through critters, and I'm trying to see if I can't make a different build work. Not looking good, though.
Mercenary doesn't shoot or do anything. It just literally gives me more interest. At the end. The orange one uh, charges you. Pretty much one shots you if it can hit you. move. Look at that move. Girl, look at his body. It'll work out. I'm a snake. Magician. Okay, that did say 14, and now at level 2, it does say 28. So maybe they do get better at level 2. Beastmaster is a rogue. Also spawns critters. You can't blame me for that. Plus 15% chance to get a crit hit. Spawns two critters if it crits. Yep. You're on the team. Gives the rogue synergy. Yep, I saw that. We're not even set on mage right now. We could switch. Whatever we want. Critter build. Okay, ow, that hurt me. Curse me when you do that. Need healing orbs. do for an item here. Malchion. Scout. Probably should start stacking up the money with the mercenary, maybe. We're doing okay. Let me put that guy in front. Maybe that guy. Yeah, let's do that. Some get better. Couldn't figure out why the level two would do, so they tried to not add anything for them. I'll have to reread that in a moment. Where the fuck was I supposed to go? It's over. Because of these white guys shooting. I don't know, what was I supposed to do? also be said about the police in America. Ouch. Get those guys before they shoot you. I'm in danger. We're doing it. Strafing him. Strafing him. Keep strafing him. I'm a strafe master. Caught in a strafe dojo. Echo Barrage. We do have AoE on my magician. Centipede, higher movement speed. Mages cast their spells faster. Merc steal plus X percent damage or X is how much gold that you have. We could go mage build. We could go merc build. No Atomicrops tonight. I beat Atomicrops flat out. And I think I'm done with the Tom Crops for a while. I hope they update the game. 
Plus movement speed could be pretty powerful too. So the AoE would be good for Magician. And then Chronomancy would be good for Magician. I'm gonna go Chronomancy. I'm feeling it. Vag. Like any of these. Level two that. Level three that. Speed could be really good. Um, maybe I'm downplaying the importance of speed here. Possible. The orange guy charges you, you're dead. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter who was hit, when, how, what, when, where, who, why. You're done. Okay, wow. What was I supposed to do to dodge that? Keep my Merc alive, though, so I can get that interest. Airpin turns. We need something here. A couple more magicians. They're just mages. They're not sorcerers. Ah! Silencer is really good, though. Curses five nearby enemies for six seconds, preventing them from using their special attacks. White guys can't shoot. Orange guys can't dash. Blue guys can't drop bombs. Purple guys can't spawn. Outlaw. Another rogue. That was a fan of five knives, each dealing 14.3 damage. You're in. The jester. Cursey boy. Full rogue. I'm going to try to go for full ro rogue build here. I don't even think that the upgrade, though, for six rogues is that good. Oh, Jesus. I didn't even see the blue guy. I'm supposed to silence him, you dip. There we go. There we go. Silence the orange one, but because the orange one had already, like, lined up a shot, didn't work. Still getting annihilated. We're getting annihilated by the orange ones. Mage, thank you for just AoEing that whole area. Take them all out. Alright, that went pretty fast. Post. Apparently there's more mages out there. Enemy defense, minus enemy defense, if I can get more mages. The rogue is chance to crit ally, two allied rogues. Okay, the crit one, that's pretty good. I was thinking maybe of the uh, ranger one is not that good. Sorcerer. Sorcerers repeat their attacks on 246. Every 432 attacks. There was one thing that was like on sorcerer repeat. Do this, this, this. Okay. It was an elite. Let's go. Halfway through the game. Have you tried turret plus wizard? No. What's the blue elite gonna do? Just drop bombs? What is it doing? I don't understand. Was I supposed to be afraid? Hardening. Plus 150 defense to all allies after an ally dies. Taunt. Chance for constructs. 
max curse targets. We do have Jester Curses for the Knife Explosion and Lightning Strike. He was silenced? He wasn't in the beginning. What am I watching? I just got here. It's called Snake RX. It's a snake roguelike. Rogues shoot a lot, so you get a lot of lightning. Fully upgraded, see what happens. Beastmaster. Get in there. Keep, I'm trying to keep a bunch of money, too, so we get that interest. I get another merchant, though, in there. Nope. Elementor is a mage. 14 AoE damage on a large area centered on a random target. We could fill for the time being. It takes three to get the mage upgrade, though. We don't have room for that. Let's just forget about it. We're going to hopefully see a lot of lightning, chain lightning. That does not include the curses that are being shot out from my dudes. I don't think. Whatever we're doing, it's working. Whatever we're doing, it's pretty good. That gunner. I am. The other enemies tank the orange guys. I understand that the orange guys hit the enemies first, but what do I do with that information? All right, full poison. Pretty Timmy, thanks the seven months. Realize it's at my seven month. Love all your content, huts. Appreciate the sub. Projectiles plus Jester. From Jester. Plus Lightning. I don't think the curses. They're not projectiles. It's a curse. I don't think that counts towards any of that. Oh, but, but I guess maybe that's what you meant. He curses them, it causes them to explode. And those four, the, the four uh, explosion things could cause chain lightning, maybe. Yes, that's, that's probably what you meant. Sorry, I was confused for a moment there. I thought you were talking about the actual curse itself. Cannoneer. We're not any of these things. Almost level 3 Magician, which is plus 50% attack speed every 12 seconds for 6 seconds, so we already have plus 35% Mage attack speed. I did say that the Mage thing maybe wasn't worth it, but because I have this Chronomancy, maybe we should think about if they are Mage to take them. Wait a minute. Cast their spells faster. Plus 20% attack speed to all allies. Let's do it. Alright. So everyone's going to be shooting faster, and hopefully we're, there's going to be more lightning. Mages should be just popping out their AoE attacks like crazy. Seems good. This seems like a good build. I like it. Keep everybody alive. It's hard to steer an eight long snake. Ladies. <laughs> Don't lose the back guy. 
Keep steering him into danger. Infesting strike. 10, 20, 30% chance for attacks to spawn critters on kill. Position 7 will stay alive for 10 seconds after dying. Hive. Critters have plus 1, 2, 3 HP. Kinetic strike. Chance for attacks to push enemies away with high force. Reroll. I wouldn't mind infesting strike because the critters are pretty good. We don't have anything going on with the critter critters though. We just have a beast master. I think we can do better. Burning Strike, Divine Barrage. We don't do healing orbs. Ranger Arrows, we don't have a Ranger. Ultimatum, projectiles that chain gain damage with each chain. We do have Chain Lightning on everything. All right. Ah, heck. We have a lot of chain lightning happening here, so that should be good. Plus 30% per chain. So if it jumps, how many people does it jump? Five people? Is that plus 150% damage on the last guy? I'm sorry, back guy, you deserve better. my mage, I think, in the back. Yeah. What are you gonna do? They got a speed boost. Rogue projectile chains. Yes, it does. Scout also chains, so I don't know if if it counts the lightning strike. Fifteen percent chance for proje projectiles to chain. Fifteen percent chance for projectiles to create chain lightning, dealing one hundred percent damage. It might not, even though it look it looks like a lightning bolt. Maybe it only applies to my scout. Pyro, it's red, but it's not a rogue. You get Enchanter Synergy as well. Plus damage to all allies. What if I took Squire? Take the Squire. Who am I going to get rid of? Plus 20% damage and defense to all allies. And then plus damage to all allies. A silencer? Is it time? Get rid of a rogue? Am I not gonna go for a full crit build though? Get rid of the merchant? Get rid of the merchant. We'll see how that goes. Barry. Artificer. Automation. No. Nope. Keep silencer. It saved you many times. Great. We'll just, we'll just not get money. Perfect. Who needs money anyways? Silence him. Silencer! Ah! That was lucky. We can honestly go for a curse synergy here. We have the curse for the Jester Phantom Knife thing. And we have a curse for the Silencer. This is 
a roguelike snake. Assassin is a rogue, throws a piercing knife that deals damage and plus damage per second. Dual gunner is a rogue. If we got rid of two things right now, we could get full rogue build. Gotta pee. Hear me out. Get rid of the magician. And our new squire. I'd rather get rid of a rogue. You understand I'm going for a rogue build. Getting rid of a rogue would ruin my rogue build. Specifically. I'm doing it. Then I can get rid of my chronomancy. Mages cast their spells faster because we don't have any mages anymore. Psych, we have Chronomancer, which is plus 20% attack speed to all allies. I don't think it casts that. You'll lose 35% damage and 20% damage, but I also gained 30% chance to crit dealing four times damage on pretty much everybody. Not a crafter. You're throwing off vibes right now that you never, ever use defensive moves in Pokemon. Only attack. Gotta do the math, man. Why not keep both? I have a party of eight out of eight. Pull up. Level 3 Scout. That's pretty dope. Plus 25% damage per chain. And plus 3 chains! That's so good with ultimatum. Plus 30% damage per chain. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, in Pokemon, they don't come in swarms. Man of Knives. Dealing. Outlaw seems pretty shit. I wouldn't mind getting rid of Outlaw for a different rogue, but... For the rogue build, yes, necessary. Upgrades it. Dual gunner level 2 feels good. Chronomancer level 2. Alright, let's try it out. Let's see what go what happens. It's an elite battle, so it might not be representative of what's actually going on here. We have a lot of tier 2. We're not really having a lot of tier 3. We haven't upgraded our shop much. Could be maybe why we're not leveling well enough. Purple is going to be um, all these little guys. The tiny babies. If the, if the elite touches you, it kills whatever it touches. That seems pretty freaking good, though. I think this is uh, the right way to go. Global damage, defense, and ASPD if you have one or more enchanters. We do have an enchanter. Reinforce could be really good there. 
area size we have aoe on mm, nobody psyker aoe damage i'm gonna go reinforcement and just beef it immediately Wow. Wow. Okay, wow. Ooh. Oh. Ah. I'm killing them before they're done spawning. Look at that. I've got the power. Ooh, ah, ah, ah. They make every game look easy. Did the math, I guess. I, okay, like to be honest, and this isn't like to blow smoke up my ass or anything like that, but I, I notice a huge difference in my ability to multi, multitask um, at my age than I did 10 years ago. Like, let's say that like back when I was like 15 and I was like, yeah, Starcraft is my favorite game, but I, I didn't like, I couldn't fucking, I couldn't handle it. I couldn't, I couldn't do it. I would just do like the campaign, but I would still like be playing on easy. And now I'm like campaign hard mode, like all the way. And I'm like canceling all this shit. And it's just, my brain can just do that. I don't know when or how that happened, but just is a thing. Helps that I do this for a job, I'm sure. That's my Atomicrops problem. Why are you still getting interest? The merchant gives you plus one interest per 10. Instead of your standard one. Merchant gives you more. Crushing souls. The chaining. It's the chaining. It's all the chaining. Someone hit me. You gonna put up with that? Tomacropt is more like a did you snort crack before you started kind of a problem, I feel like. We keep going with the silencer. I don't really see why we wouldn't keep going with it. It's it does seem pretty powerful. It's we also have a cursor synergy here. Plus one max curse target. We can think about getting rid of a rogue for a better rogue. Um, Outlaw being one of them. Jester maybe being one of them. I like the Beastmaster critter uh, on crits. Because that works really well with the crits. Uh, the Scout's Chaining is really, really good, even though it's tier one. Assassin Piercing Knife. Assassin... Here, poison inflicted from crits deals 8x damage. That sounds really good if we could get a fully upgraded assassin, but he's level one right now. And then the dual gunner really doesn't do a whole lot for me besides the fact that it shoots really quickly, it shoots multiple projectiles, and that's gonna proc my chain lightning a lot more. Beast is underwhelming, IMO. I would say on the chopping block would be Outlaw and Beastmaster. If we can pull, like, a higher level, um, rogue, specifically. We're at level 21. We gotta make moves now, because level 25 is the final level. I think Beast Master, the only problem with it right now, I think, is it's having a harder time 
killing things to spawn the critters. I mean, we have like 10 critters on screen right now. So like, maybe it's not so bad. Maybe we should actually be buffing our critters. Maybe that's the problem. If we had that uh, Baneling burst, that'd be pretty saucy. I don't know how we almost lost our purple guy already. Yeah, maybe dual gunners are worth keeping. Like I said, just because of the chain lightning. They just shoot so many projectiles. That is a really tough way because of the orange dudes. Homing barrage. Chance to release a homing barrage on enemy kill. All warriors. We have warriors. We have one warrior. There's a fan of knives. One of my least favorites. Flying daggers. All projectiles thrown by a rogue's chain plus two, three, four times. Does that mean somebody like Beastmaster that doesn't chain at all now chains two or three or four? It says all projectiles thrown by rogues, not just chaining projectiles thrown by rogues. Okay, that's the uh, definitely, definitely that one. If I didn't do that one, I'd do speed three and put dual gunners there, and it would just be like. Brrr. I too spawn critters when I cry. I'm gonna go flying daggers. But critters spawn on crit. Did I miss something? Did I stutter? Level 3 silencer is going to be um, 52 damage per second on the curse. Which is, that's pretty good. Chop upgrade. Too late now. I think we might be riding this out to the end. There's only like three more levels left. It, it, this is pretty saucy. Yeah, I think that, that, yeah. Okay, just look at the chaining. Just look at the dick chaining. You guys hear that uh, Obama's, he got his generals pierced? He's got a dick shady. Really, really, really old humor that no one gets because he's not president anymore. He breaks everything. They handed me these synergies, really. And I'm glad, I'm actually, I'm really happy that we went a different route. We went the rogue route and it, uh, it's really working out. It's good. Islander, need it. Gotta have it. Only one though. Does Jester Dagger start chaining if they hit? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that counts as a separate projectile or if that counts as um, a rogue projectile. Dad, I'm gonna bite you. Upgrade our shop. I guess we'll buy another Jester. Nuker, Cursor Swarmer, Enchanter Healer. Scout. We already have a level 3 Scout. We can't do anything more than that. Level 4 Shop. 10% chance of getting uh, a, a Tier 1. We get two of them. 10% chance? You say? You sure about that? Infuses projectiles with chain lightning that deal 20% damage to two enemies. Projectiles that chain gain each... Okay, what if I did Stormweaver, though? Would that be important? Everything gains plus uh, uh, two chains. What would I get rid of? 
plus 20% attack speed to all allies? Probably not. Silencer? Probably not. Well, then I'm shit out of luck. Then I'm not doing it. You already have an item for that. Yeah, but it would buff that item. They would work together. It would rule the galaxy together. Why am I only getting upgrades on my least favorite? Yuck. No, I'm gonna starve. There goes the snake pharmacy. Snake pharmacy? No healers today. Our goal right now is to kill everything before they have a chance of hurting me. It's kind of like that thing I do when I try to date and I push everybody away before they have a chance to hurt me and break up with them really quickly. It works out great. No one gets close enough to hurt this snake. Wang, thanks for three months. Quank sounds like something from, uh, Ratchet and Clank. Quark? Two real odds. You okay, mate? Yeah, I'm in a steady relationship right now, so... Everything's good. Ratchet and Quank. You know, the, the latest Ratchet and Clank game, I was, I was uh, interested in, in trying it. I used to love that shit back in the day. The whole, like, concept of, like, using a weapon more makes it more upgraded. That, that was dope. Forced you to use a bunch of different weapons that you wouldn't normally use. It was a blast. That is a level 3 silencer. What are you going to do? The uh, curse damage. That's really good. Good, 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 good. Uh, 24. We have an elite. And then we have the super elite after that. I think we we're, we got a lock in here. That's what we got going on. That slows enemies by 50% for two seconds on sorcerer spell repeat. I don't think we have a sorcerer spell repeat. Haste. Healing orb. Position six takes 10% health as damage every three seconds. Nope. Enemy spawns with minus max health. I'm gonna try to do better than that. When an ally dies, chance to burn. Defense to all allies when an ally dies. Enemies taking damage over time. Damage have minus movement speed. We do have 52 damage per second damage over time from our silencer now. Tacos are here. Thanks for the five months. Appreciate that. We also have damage over time from our noxious strike. Reroll again, you think? Minus 35% movement speed on a boss could be pretty good. And I'm going to try it. What do I really want? I want another gesture. All knives seek enemies. They're heat seeking enemies and pierce two times. If I can get one more gesture. Tier two. Last level. Here's what I'm gonna do. 
Outlaw, we need three more of them. We can't afford that. I'm going to sell shop levels. I right clicked. We don't get money back for that? It costs money to reset the shop? Costs money to set the shop back. I thought I got money. Big brain time. What the frick was that, you frick? Alright. That doesn't make any sense to me. I thought we did that before and I got a bunch of money, but I guess I was wrong. This is the super final boss. It's dead. It's already dead. Achievement unlocked. New game plus one. Sick, bro. Why are you acting like you aren't just going to delete that boss? Loop! Got a loop. At least once. Let's get some level three shits. There we go. Level three jester. And two more jesters on top. Level 3 Outlaw, plus 50% Outlaw attack speed and Knives Seek. So that's the throwing the fans of, of, of uh, yeah, that was garbage. But now that they seek, that could be okay. We can work with that. We also want Beastmaster. We want one more Chronomancer. If we can get to level 3, that's enemies take damage over time 50% faster, which could go really well with the 52 damage per second Silencer Curse. Poison inflicted from crits deals 8x damage. On the assassin. That's dope. We're critting like crazy. If they can last that long. Alright, we need three more assassins. Two more dual gunners. One more chronomancer. And one more beastmaster. Boom. Damn, enemies take damage over time 50% faster. Let's go. Party size increase. You are absolutely right. I forgot that after you loop, you get one more in your party. Okay, the fan of knives is pretty good with the homing. Just gonna throw it out there. Stormweaver, plus damage to all allies. Get in there. We're gonna have a thief, don't we? We don't have a thief? It was a knife that deals 26 damage and chains five times. We have to have a thief. Time to get rid of the Beastmaster. Let's trade him for a thief. Thief is really good. We get the, the chaining. So not only is it chained five times, but it chains four more times. Gains 30% damage with each chain. Bruh. Bruh. Imagine being merciful. Kill them more. That's called the rage quit. They gave up. Game broke. The game definitely broke there. It spawned half of the first wave and was like, we're done. There's still enemies in the screen. We did this last time. Instantly kill the elites below blah, max HP. AOE, we don't do AOE. Chance for burning. Create an area that pulls enemies in for one second on sorcerer spell repeat. Burning maybe at this point in time, but it's our last item slot, and I think we should really go out with a bang. Ally dies, burning, psyker orb, ranger arrows. Voider dies. Curse targets. Curse applies doom. 
I, I've never seen Doom before. I would go Malediction maybe for the um, Silencer Curse. Chain Lightning's trigger area of effect the number of units hit is doubled. Oh my god. Go Doom! Monkey's out. See you, monkey. Let's try Doom. This one's maybe rare if I've never seen it before. Kill everything too quickly for Malediction Silencer. Well, we, we the, the Doom is the same thing, but... Only thing that we don't kill that quickly would be, like, the, the bosses. Wow. Oh my god. Welcome to the Shredder. Doom is kind of like Doom and Hades. Okay, so if we could just kill the first wave that spawns fast enough, the game quits. Write that down. Dive into the area where the first place is. Yep. That was the elite! Okay. Well, I think we found the, the, the best build so far. Full rogue. And it, there's still so many enemies on screen when it just quits. We already have an outlaw. We need one more dual gunner, two more assassins, and like 10 more thieves. It's a tier three and a tier two, and we're sitting here at uh, 45 percent chance for tier two, 20 percent chance for tier three. So we're really looking at getting our last dual gunner right now. Wow. Not over there. Yeah, waves spawned, jumped to three from me killing that first wave so hard. Game said no. wasn't ready for me being this powerful. Upgraded assassin. Poison inflicted from crits deal 8x damage. Dual gunner, level 3. Every fifth attack shoots in rapid succession for two seconds. We need some storm weavers up in here, which is a tier 3. We're looking at 45% chance for tier 3. We also need a tier 4 thief. We should see storm weaver right now. High chance. Just dive bombed him. We lost somebody. No. Level two's 
Stormweaver. Once again, level 3 Stormweaver is going to be Chain Lightning Trigger. Area of Effect and Number of Unit Hits is doubled. Area of Effect on Chain Lightning. I need it in my mouth. Like six more of them, though, to get to level three. Good elite. Good elite battle, guys. Good job. Well done. Good hustle out there, you guys. Good hustle. Give me that storm weaver. I got hit there. I got hit. Second place dude's hurting. No, I'm gonna storm. No, this is Patrick Rogue. What do you want me to do to get more Stormweaver? We should maybe go through our items again and make sure that we don't have something that we could just dump off. We probably have some pretty underwhelming ones. Poison over time might be one that gets the axe. We could probably do better. Enemies take 30% more damage. That probably could go as well. Poison. Chain Lightning, I'm keeping that one. Projectiles that chain, do more damage. I'm definitely keeping that one. Plus global damage, defense, and ASPD. What's ASPD? We do have an enchanter. So plus 30% global damage. That sounds pretty good. Projectiles thrown by rogues, chain more. Yes. And enemies taking damage over time have minus movement speed. Yeah. ASPD is attack speed. Plus 30% damage, defense, and attack speed. If you have one or more enchanters. That's yeah, that's really good. Curses apply doom. Whoops. It was cool, but watch me just get slaughtered right now. <laughs> we were just completely reliant on doom and we had no idea. Honestly, the Outlaw, that was one of my least favorite guys. We upgraded to level three, and because they home and just, like, they really home. The ones that are circling constantly. Yeah, that's good. That's all suck. Oh, warriors. We don't even have no warrior, do we? We have one warrior, the fan of five knives. It's the Outlaw. Warriors have 50, 70, 100% attack speed based on missing HP. Ceremonial dagger. Killing an enemy fires a homing dagger. Projectile damage. Plus 50. Per we are throwing projectiles out the ass. Killing an enemy fires a homing dagger would be great. Or a ballista. Just plus 50% projectile damage. Just out the gate. Dagger, Ballista, 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 put the chat on the screen. Ballista, 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 Ballista. Yeah. Both are great. I'm going to get rid of poison. Storm, weave me. Three more storm weavers. Don't forget, we're also looking for thieves. Two more storm weavers. 
immediately dies. Yeah, right. I should try one where I just don't even... I don't change the direction of the... The guy moving at all. The snake. Did you just assume the... Gender of the snake? Alright, not moving. Uh oh. We're fine. We're fine. We're not fine, we're dying! Front runners are down. They dove right into the blue bombs. Can't do that. Not allowed. We're not invincible. One more storm weave. Give it to me. I want it. I want it. I didn't get it. Cause I don't like it. I love it, love it, love it. Come on. Elite. Dead. Dead. Sam, my cousin Ray Ray. Oop. Dead. Unwavering stance. Divine punishment. Wake me up inside. Max speed and damage to one mage every round for that round. Secondary AoE blasts. Stormweaver will create an area of effect blast. But not yet. Chance to stun. That could be really good. Taking damage also shares that across all enemies. More stun. Meat shield. I think they're out of ideas. We've seen all the items. That's why we're getting stunning strike every time. Go. I'm, I'm out of money. Can I borrow some money, chat? How much snake money do you have? Can you guys please subscribe with... Snake Prime Plus. Give me that last storm we were before we upgrade our shop. Son of a bitch. <laughs> No. No, 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 no. Five more levels and we're done. With this loop. The wave glitch giving you less money. It does seem like it's giving me less money, doesn't it? It doesn't seem like we're getting a whole lot of money. Possible. Oh, the the, uh, the shop didn't upgrade. Okay, I thought it just automatically upgrade. You're gonna loop until you die. Probably not. It's 11 p.m. my time. He's not getting interest. 
And did I forfeit my interest rights? Maybe on loop you don't get interest? I don't know. Maybe you get less money on loop. Maybe we're getting tons of money and we're just spending all of it. I got three entries there. Son of a bitch. All right, chain lightning's trigger area of effect and number of units hit is doubled. Of course, it's only gonna hit two enemies, but if it does work with some of these things, Maybe they'll chain more. Now we're just looking for thief. We need three more thieves. Stun is underwhelming. Oh, stun is super underwhelming, but we were re-rolling until I had no money left. And I didn't see anything better. guy is constantly shooting. Every like fourth attack or something like that does like a blast of like like a lot of shots. I don't like it. I love it, love it, love it. Whoa. So good, it hurts. I remember Flow Rider. Just me. Uh, Florida, the state. Flow Rider. What a rap name, right? So crazy out there, like people can be, be so big, especially in the rap game, and then it's just like bleh, gone. Not heard the name Flo Rida in years. That's what I'm talking about. What happened? He rides the flow. That's really funny, by the way. I don't know if you guys know that. I just need three more thieves. Give it to me. One more. For a fully upgraded super team. One more. Give it to me. You got it. Yeah, buddy. The knife, if the knife crits, it deals 520 damage, chains 10 times, and grants one gold. Bruh. Instead of 104 damage, chaining five times, which is not five times, is nine times, 10 times being 14 times. What is 14? What is it? How would you do that math? If there's a plus 30% chance of chaining per chain, that'd be 30% times 14, right? That's like a lot of numbers. That's a number. So take 520 damage. Multiply that by 14 chains. Multiply that by 130% damage. Something like that. That's what I was trying to say. The 30% uh, with each chain damage. The ultimatum. That's, yeah. Let's go, baby. Cause I don't like it. I love it, love it, love it. Whoa.
Okay. First and last positions have plus damage. Well, I could stick my... Uh, I, anybody. Anybody there and that'd be good. Let's do it. Hmm, who should we put there? Probably the one that we were just talking about. My thief. Put you in the back. Put you in the front. Chain. Probably the other chain guy. Maybe even the outlaw. The outlaw has been pretty good. We'll do the damage in the outlaw. PK, 100 bits. Oh, first of all, the tacos here. Did I read that one right? No idea I was still subbed. All right, nice. If I missed you, tacos, I'm, I apologize. PK, uh, this is how you know you are strong when you get first frame kill. Remember that you meant OP, not OW? Let's do it. That's full send. Don't blink. Not, not as strong in the super final ultimate boss. That's pretty good though. Spelling's hard. Touch strong or spawn killing. All right, you guys, I'm gonna call it here. Thank you guys on YouTube for watching. I appreciate you. Let me know if you like this Snake RX and if you want me to play more of it. Hit the like button if you did. And I'll see you in the next one. See you guys.